Yeah, we bought a guitar pick that's uh, too sharp. This is a Jim Dunlop Jazz Tone 208. Uh, it's, it's brand new. You can see the uh, nice shiny surface there. Um, I've noticed that Jim Dunlop sell a lot of guitar picks that are sharpened at one end. And so rather than buying a whole bunch of guitar picks that are sharp, having to buy sacks of them, I bought a sharpening stone at an Asian supermarket for uh, about five bucks, five bucks eighty maybe. And I just want to try uh, sharpening a guitar pick on it. So that's brought it to quite a bit of a point already. I'll give it a bit more of a, a bit more of a vigorous rub. Uh, not holding it on a really uh, definite angle like you would sharpen a, a drill bit or something, but that's uh, that's created quite a sharp not sharpening on that side. And uh, look, we'll do the same. On that side, and uh, look at that, we've got a guitar pick that's sort of sharpened, and um, I think that might have been the smooth side, and this is the rough side, so I probably should have started on this side, but so I'll sort of sharpen that off a bit more. Yeah, that's the rough side, that's, that's cutting it into it quite a bit more, so we'll do that. Yep, that's that's very sharp and that's that's quite a bit rough there. You can see the texture is a bit rough, so we will flip it over. Like that. And like that. And there we go. We have a sh guitar pick that I've sharpened on uh, on that side. It took all of about even me crapping on about it took two minutes so yeah don't 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 spend a lot of money on buying sharp guitar picks sharpen them yourself with it go to an asian grocer look where they have all those uh, knives and uh, choppers and stuff like that and grab yourself a stone you can sharpen them yourself peace out